Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Nota Nugosi, and I make lifestyle beauty and image creative content. So, that's what you're about, and that's what you want to see more of. Please do subscribe, and then don't forget to turn on your post notification bell so that you get notified every single time I post a new video. And then, if you're a returning subscriber, a German subscriber, what do you do, baby? Welcome back, and thank you again for joining me today. So, as you can see from the title of today's video, today's video is um hey get ready with me hey install hey review whatever and today's video is brought to you by love me hey uh and then don't forget to follow me on my instagram which will be right here honestly i have nothing but good things to say about this hair it's amazing i love it it's a 10 out of 10 i look pretty like love me hey guys every time i work with them all their wigs are just from the calm like the lace melted like Thank you, ma'am. But anyways, I absolutely love this hair and without pleasure to you, um, let's get into today's video. So as I said, you guys, this wig is brought to you by Love Me Hair. And then in this box, they gave me a satin bag, which just has um, elastic bands as well as um, headbands. And then they also gave me two wig caps and then the wig we are going to be working with today is this girl right here which is a 22 inch i believe water wave wig i think it is hd lace i went ahead and plucked the wig as you can see i did go bleach the knots but the knots came bleached so i think i just like overdid the thing but yeah this hair um is a ready to wear i think well i believe it like could pass off as a ready to wear because it comes already bleached and already plugged so all you can just do is just put the wig on your head and you're good to go but yeah um i absolutely love this hair like i have nothing like bad to say about it or like yeah nothing bad to say about it as yet but yeah um without further ado let's get to installing this wig Okay, so first things first, I am going to go in with my mousse. This just helps um, lay the baby hair off the wigs down and all just the flowers. It helps them um, stay in place so that they don't interfere with me um, laying the wig down. And then I'm going to go in with my Got To Be You Blasting Free Spray and I'm just going to spray that across the hairline. And then I just use this purple erectile comb to just sink in everything and make sure that the hair um, isn't interfering with installing the wig and then afterwards I'm going to go in with my hair dryer and I use it in the cool and hot mode so mode one and two on my hair dryer and then now i'm just gonna go in with my razor to cut the lace guys i recently just bought this um um eyebrow razor and it's literally not working for me like i think it's too sharp or i don't know what but it's not working for me so as you can see i decided to go in with my scissors because that's all i had and yeah when you're using your scissors you just need to be careful so that you don't um uh cut in a shade line because if you cut in a shade line your hairline will look weird um you have to go in a zigzag motion i know it's hard but just try and then i'm going to go back in with my blasting free spray and to just um get rid of that um white line that you guys see um basically that's the lace that lifted while i was cutting um the lace and i use the um, ragtail comb to make my application of the glue more accurate and then i go in with my hair dryer again in the hot and cold mode um, to just dry the wig so that it's not sticky and then when I place the band which I'm doing right now um, it doesn't basically stick onto the wig and then when I take it off the lace lifts basically and yeah and then afterwards I'm going to remove my band don't mind my eyebrows guys I was starting to do my makeup look and yeah So now I'm going to start the process of parting my baby hair and guys can you see that lace like can you see that hairline like can you see it? <laughs> 
but yeah that's all i'm gonna be doing now i think i actually go um um off camera to just finish off because i was literally having a hard time but yeah this is basically what i do with my baby hair But because I didn't show the part where I lay my baby hair on camera, I do use the mousse and then I also use my got to use gel. I use the gel um, by the roots and then I lay down everything with the mousse. I don't know if what I'm making makes sense. I mean what I'm saying makes sense but yeah that's basically what I do. And then now I am going to basically blend in my makeup with the frontal and yeah guys now that is done this is how the hair is looking i did over bleach my hair as i said in the beginning as you can see it looks like there's a bald spot here but i'm gonna fix that with mascara like there's no bald spot it's just the hair is too brown so yeah and you can see like a lot of places look like that which is cool i can just quickly fix it like it's no biggie and um the highlight of this video you guys is this baby i finally got myself a like stick okay or whatever and i am going to use it because today i am doing a half up half down hairstyle and yeah i just want to have a cute i wish i was actually going to me but anyways um yeah so that's what you're going to see me doing in the next clip so i am going to go in with my new wax stick <laughs> i actually didn't use a lot of it because i wasn't sure like how much to put and blah blah blah, blah. And then i'm gonna go in with my hot comb to just um flatten everything on the front and basically melt my wax stick also and yeah so I'm about to do the half up half down hairstyle and I'm just putting this band so that my lace doesn't lift while I just um, basically pull on the wig and yeah this part guys like it takes forever like your arms will literally become so painful because you're trying to part the wig everything is just everything basically and it's just a mess but yeah this process basically needs patience and as you can see right now i'm going in with a shoelace which you guys will see does not work um out for me so later on in the video you'll see i will go in with my stocking which is literally 10 out of 10 um for everything like literally for everything and then i will go in with my scrunchie i got the scrunchie from shein and then yeah So basically for this look i wanted like a poofy puffed out look so i did not go in with like any products um i did not go in with water i did not go in with my um on jackie's thingy thingy like i just wanted to keep it raw and guys did you see what just happened like wow guys did you just see that that was a spiritual attack that's what i'm saying but yeah i think i love this wig like this like i'm not gonna put any water or any mousse on it it's like i love it puffy and everything the only thing i think i'm gonna put mousse on this part so it like stays flat flat but after oh i was gonna say after that disaster i don't know where my mousse is but i just found it which is great so yeah I know I said I'm not gonna put any products on this wig, but a girl's gotta do what a girl's gotta do. And if you wanna learn how to define your curls, you can watch my other videos. I have plenty of curly hair videos that you can watch. Um, but yeah, today I'm just going for the poofy look. 
which I absolutely adore. So now let's just take this off. <laughs> Who is she? Okay, so now I said that I'm gonna fix the parts where I over bleached my wig. Um, I don't think I'll be able to do that on camera because of how intricate the process is. But basically, I'm just gonna tell you guys what I do before I go to the bathroom and do it. I look so cute. But anyways, I should have done pink makeup, but it's fine. Um, I just take my mascara and I put it like where the hair is bronze or brown and then i just basically do that in place of actually dyeing the hair um but yeah on camera i feel like it looks better but in person like people are gonna see and tell that my wig is over bleached and we don't want that so i'm just gonna fix it up a bit hopefully um but also guys like you wouldn't have to deal with this if you you have purple shampoo so as i said i don't have purple shampoo so maybe when i get it and then i'll wear this wig again i'll just wash it and then i'll tell you guys on my instagram how that went i mean yeah i love how i look anyways let me go do this mascara thing and then come back and finish off so i'm back you guys and as you can see there's so much improvement like you can see the only problem is that my wig cap shows and what i have to say about um love me hair wigs or their lace like it melts like no other lace i've ever tried ever 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 and it's a lot so that's why my wig cap shows through so if you're gonna buy their wig i think it's best to do the um, bold cap method but honestly i currently am struggling with my hairline so i'm scared of trying the bold cap method because i think my hairline is gonna like literally disappear but anyways maybe sometime in the future i will try it but anyways this hair is amazing you guys and it's not even like hot i don't know how to explain it but curly hair is like it's hot a wig is hot but this one doesn't feel like that it feels light the curls are beautiful i look beautiful everything is beautiful but anyways thank you guys for watching and do stay tuned for my next video um don't forget to like comment and subscribe and also share this video to your friends and family members that want to learn how to put on wigs or whatever but anyways without further ado i'm gonna say bye now